hold up, hold up. Before we start this video, you better smash that like button, subscribe, and put the notification bell on in the next five seconds, or Ronald McDonald will come at your front doorstep. How would it risk? If you want to edit like this. First thing you need to do is go to, to the gear and switch to Japan if you're not if you just roaming around but if you just need to do challenges switch to English. Confirm mode on release on. I use it on, but if you're good at timing, turn it off. But I'm not turning off. Put the hub skill under that green line. I don't care if you don't use it. Turn it under that green line. And try to not to use all of the HUDs. Try to use some of them. Turn your subtitles off. Turn it all extra small, white, none, and clear. Turn it off. If you have replays, turn that off too. Then you go to the key binds. Do not use switch mode slash edit to edit. Put it as a key bind that you don't use and use another edit bind that you're comfortable with. I don't use L stick to edit because that made my controller drift a lot because I kept smashing the button and I had a left stick drift. And that's all with the set. Second is timing. Timing is very key to see you can use practices and you just gotta edit and then use your either confirm to do it and then just keep doing that. Just practice. Edit, reset, edit, reset. That's a good practice. Edit, reset. Because if you edit and shoot, you gotta reset so you don't get hit by a thing. So you see me practicing this. Reset. Like that. That really helps me improve. And that's all for the time. Third in editing faster is crosshair placement. I'm going to show you examples of bad crosshair placement and good crosshair. This is a bad crosshair placement. That is bad. And good crosshair placement is that. You want to be closer to the line. Bad crosshair placement. Good crosshair placement. You see those four lines? Try to make your stuff closer inside. That's what I use the four lines for. To help me get my crosshair placement better. That's a bad crosshair placement, good crosshair placement. Bad crosshair placement, good crosshair placement. Bad, good. Those are bad and good crosshair placements you can see because it'll take longer for the other. That's bad. The fourth and last thing to help you with your editing is once you edit, um, get to your spot where you're about to edit next. See how I edit in the windows? Once I edit and try to reset, I go to the spot that I'm about to edit. See that? I prepare for the next edit. That's basically all I'm trying to say. To so prepare for the next edit. Plus, you can't edit reset like once you edit the window, you can't edit the um edit in between the window and get your edit back. Only if you have your building building piece out. But if you have your gun out and trying to shoot, you gotta prepare for the next edit so the so the person won't shoot at you. Just edit reset and make sure you reset because if you edit, you can shoot and reset. This is all for you. Have fun.